Now back in 1915, a wealthy British barrister named Cecil Chubb went to an auction in Salisbury without knowing what was up for bid. When he saw that the Stonehenge Prehistoric Monument was on the list, well, that was it. Cecil bid a mammoth 6,600 pounds on a lark. That's just over $1 million today. Some people think he wanted to give it to his wife Mary as a gift, while most others think he was afraid an American investor would buy it and ship it off to the States. Hey, think London Bridge. But three years later, Chubb decided to give it to the UK and sign the deed over with his wife Mary. He even made sure that locals could visit for free and that admission fees would never be more than one shilling. Of course, inflation is a thing, and today you'll have to shell out 23 pounds to get in, about $28. Chubb's generosity didn't go unnoticed, though. He was knighted and became known as Viscount Stonehenge.